Ben, who we said not long ago, just won a single WTS race. Looks like she's in a fantastic position to double that tally. Last season, although she was superbly consistent, she was disappointed not to take the title. Holland pipped her at the death, but she's starting 2019 in the best possible way. Time to high five, and Sophia Reds, running the second time, wins a WTS event, and she's done it in a really gutsy way. Victory in Abu Dhabi in the United Arab Emirates seven weeks ago. And she's going to win again here in Bermuda. And not just win, she can high five every single spectator and still win. She's absolutely trounced the field and puts herself in pole position to win her first time. Look at the time she's got the hug. Sofia wins in just shy of two hours. Hello and a warm welcome to the third stop. We're in Japan, Yokohama to be precise. True grit, tactically absolutely superb. Who is there that can challenge this woman this year? Doesn't look to be anyone. And Zafirez unbeatable in 2019. Montreal in Quebec, Canada was the fifth stop. The Brit could give no more and Zafirez a phenomenal performance. Now four wins out of five. Arguably her best display of a stellar season. The final chapter of the 2019 ITU World Triathlon Series was written in the superbly scenic Swiss city of Lausanne. A star-studded field of 65 women was headed by Katie Zafirez after a stellar season. She finally put some daylight between her and her pursuer close home. And from then on, it was a glorious sprint to the line to claim her first world title. It's been a brilliant season after missing out so narrowly 12 months earlier. No mistake in 2019, her fifth victory of the season. A lot of support from oh, so many people and um, just enjoying myself and getting out there and taking it step by step, focused on the process.